say I am playing the Ancaster Leak. Whatever. I, I, I know literally nothing about this game. So let's see what happens. No pause button. I see. Well, I have to have some way to be seen. And you, you guys saw, like, the, the warning at the beginning. User warning, of course. Yeah, I don't want to... Yeah. I, I, I don't know about this. Credit. Sheep. What's this? Uh oh, that's opening my browser. Uh, nope. Nope, 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 hold on. My... I wasn't expecting that to open up a tab. I was not ready for tabs to be open. I have my browser closed for a reason. Nope, don't, don't you start playing my YouTube videos. Don't you start playing the videos I was watching. I, I don't even have an ed video editor. I, I can't edit videos. This part's staying in, I guess. You guys get to know how long it takes for my browser to load. Which, oh, wait, nope, uh, and cast uh, and the task manager stuff, sure, why, why not, why, why not let the task manager pop up? Yeah, sure. Okay, there we go. We're good. Where was it? Uh, oh wait, I don't even use my real name on the file name. Okay. I might have to check this out later on my own time. Huh? What does that mean? I don't... what? Training protocols. Oh! Oh, this, this is the training protocol. Okay, that, that, yeah, now I see why there was a seizure warning, if that makes sense. Did it... Oh, no. Entity Research Department. It's like SCP. You can use Agent. Oh, wait, th is this me? Nice. Uh. YouTube, but that password will not work. Uh, oh, it's 79 now. Wait, is that actually the temperature right now? No, no. Why, why would I even think that's the temperature? It's the... Okay, uh, I guess we'll do face detection. Sure. Throughout ERB research, there has been one constant. Me. Entities who possess human characteristics are the most violent, deceptive, and are the greatest threat to public security. Yes, so me, okay, I get it. It is imperative that agents have the skills to not only detect potential threats, but fast. Yeah, that makes sense. CRD has found the one-year agent fatality rate goes down from 34.7 per 100 to 26.2 per 100 after taking this module, and being proficient in this skill. That's... something. 
Using your cursor, click on the face in the image in the allotted time. Distractions may be employed. Begin. Wait, what, what am I clicking? That's a face, yeah. I'm just looking at the face. Why'd that one look familiar? Oh. That's a mask, but close enough. Yep. Jesus, this is getting worse. Uh, okay, no one else saw a face, right? Oh, uh, that's a face. Uh, uh. Oh, no, that's actually as well. Ah, I hated that. Oh god, there were two. They were both them correct. That's not really much of a face. That guy looked like... One guy looked like if Michael Myers melted. Melt man with the power to melt. That is loud. God, that was Oh, why is the music gone? Oh, that's why the music's gone. Oh, it's back. Good. The main room. Oh. Oh. That scream really got me. Brother, I need a, I need a sec. Play a lot of horror. I want to play more horror. Because I, I. Horror. I just kind of lost the touch. It's back. I looked. That was barely a jump scare and it got me. Yeah. It got me. Oh. Thirsty. Drink fresh meat. it's like it's there but like the screen is like it's like slightly off to the side so it looks like i'm looking at the gameplay it's a youtube trick i learned markiplier i think situation let's test this out oh it's orange this module has been created to address and rectify observed deviations from established protocols Reaffirming the essential principles that all ERD agents are expected to adhere to consistently. Okay, what are those? Lesson 1. CERT. CERT. CERT stands for Calmly Collect Evidence. Eliminate Threats. Run Away. And Terminate Self. Oh. Given an interaction with an entity, these are the order of actions an agent will take during escalation. First, okay. of course, is data collection, as research remains the top priority of ERD. Second, eliminate the here. threat, unless such entity is on the preservation list. A dead entity can be studied, a dead agent cannot. If fighting back is futile, agents should run. If running okay. is futile, agents should terminate themselves. Let us look at an example, where an agent didn't follow the principles of CDRT. In 1989, Agent Redacted was collecting data on Entity 59 Skinwalker. Suddenly cornered, mm. Agent Redacted fired all 12 shots of his service pistol into Entity. With no bullets left, Redacted was subjected to Entity 59 as rep. Remember to search, remember to keep an extra round. Oh, oh yeah, save one. This video is another example. Think, following the values of search, what would you do? Instantly. Terminate self. Yeah, I, I just terminate self. I'm 
Well, first off, I turn on the light, because, like, this flashlight's not doing much. Bro, run, run. This is where you run. Run, 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 run. run. Uh, now you got some distance, try and fire a shot. If you can't, shoot yourself. Okay, yeah, no, he, he just, he skipped the E. Skipped the Lesson E entirely. Two, do's and don'ts. Improvements we need in ERD. To interact with entities, if new data can be collected. Don't risk losing obtained data by interacting too much. To help co-workers gather data. Don't become friends with co-workers. Uh, you need to apologize. Do terminate co-workers who leave data. Don't hesitate, explain later. Oh. Huh. Lesson 3 Follow Mission Protocol. Okay, what's the protocol? Deviation from mission protocol endangers yourself, co workers, and data collection. Assisting civilians is strictly forbidden, unless stated otherwise in mission protocol. Reminder the punishment for deviation is termination. Let's see what's happening. In 1990, Agent Redacted was on a mission studying an entity. The entity was located at Agent Redacted's house. Agent Redacted tried and successfully saved his wife. Agent Redacted didn't follow protocol and both him and his wife were terminated. Yeah, that, that, that's evil. Very evil. This concludes the refresher. We will not remind about these topics again. See your supervisor if you have questions. A multiple question quiz about these topics will now commence. Okay. Begin. Yeah. It's begin. I guess collect the evidence. gonna try and jump out the window. Yeah, I mean, they don't want me to risk losing the data, so... Do no interfere. Got the T. Its emergence as one of the most common and dangerous entities, special training on doppelganger detection was created. Okay. Originally thought to be its own entity type, the doppelganger is rather a class of entities who visually and audibly mimic humans. Like me. Doppelgangers can be detected from their abnormal features. The most common attributes to look for are loose skin, missing features, and incorrect features. Further classification of the cell bangers can be made by observing the abnormal features. For example, skinwalkers always have loose skin. However, identification is covered in a different module. Using your cursor, click on the doppelganger amongst the humans. Okay. First off, they're calling it danger. That Begin. It's bothering me. Okay, let's try this. Uh... That works with a bug. That's a bug. 
recording it by the way trying to say hi. This training module is to practice with reaction skills on determining if something is a friend or a foe. That's the perfect time for it. Answer in the allotted time, else it will be marked incorrect. Oh I'm gonna do this one twice. Begin. Okay, friend or foe. That's not a friend. That's a threat. Probably a threat. I don't see anything in that threat. Yeah, that, that's a threat. I don't see anything. I don't want to say no threat. Oh. Oh. 
That's the threat. <laughs> I, I strongly disagree with you on that one. I actually did really well on that one. I did not expect that. But I did expect to just, just like show a picture of me. And have me be a threat. That, that would have been... That would have made sense. That's probably going to happen with this thing. Well, there's gonna be like a Snapchat filter that pop up behind me. Hit me. Agents must be able to accurately transcribe audio coming from unusual sources. Okay. Besides being able to detect incoming attacks, agents must document what entities say during encounters, as research remains oh. the number one priority. Oh god, this is this is gonna be difficult. I suck. Type this. into the console while you hear, and press enter when complete. Okay. Begin. Focus. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Do not look behind you. Okay. You are weak and replaceable. Where are you, my inner thoughts? Clap, 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 cloudy. You have a chance of rain. I assume it just means that part. Everything is fine. fine, fine, fine. Yeah. I don't see, 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 see the sun often. I don't see, 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 see the sun often. I don't know what I'm going to do. I think 
that's what I heard. Yeah, I, I didn't want to hear the rest of that one. I was getting kind of loud. I, I did not want to hear the rest of it. I, just, no, no. Okay, well. Audio transcription complete. Oh, I can't redo these. Okay, I'm going to do one of one, whatever that is. I don't think I want to know. But I'm going to anyway, I guess. Entities are otherworldly beings that humans have been encountering for thousands of years. For once was a rare sighting, entities have begun appearing more rapidly through time. This led to the founding of the Entity Research Department. The okay. RD goal is researching entities to protect the public but more importantly, finding utility in entities, and where they come from. The leading theory of where they come from is back doors, yet no back physical rooms. evidence has been found yet. Oh my god, it's the back rooms. Oh my god, it's That's the back rooms. That's where you come in. As an agent of ERD you will be conducting highly confidential research missions to explore the gain of function of entities and finding their origin. It's this SCP brief module rooms. will explain how entities are classified and show you the four entities ERD are focusing on in 1992. I can't believe they combined SCP with the back. Entities are given an ID but are often given a nickname. Some entities are given a class that link them to a family of entities. Entities okay. are classified in three ways, threat level, containment, and utility each rated by five levels. Okay. Entity, E549. Nickname, Shadow People. Class, Doppelganger. Threat, Moderate. Containment, extreme. Utility, significant. Shadow people, or night terrors, torment their prey during nights when there is low visibility, often in bedrooms, when the prey is sleeping. Paralyzing their prey during sleep, shadow people will ominously watch from a distance. It is unknown why shadow people choose to kill, as they will often torment the same subject for many years, but when they do, the victim isn't touched. To the civilian world it seems the subject died in their sleep, the research goal this year is finding out how shadow people choose their prey, and if this can be influenced. If so, E549 could be used in advanced interrogation techniques. Wait, I just realized they even have it, like, E... Entity, E718. Nickname, Matronic. Class, Machine. Threat, Aspire. Low. Containment, Easy. Utility, Moderate. Matronics take the form of animatronics. Playful figures that appeal to children. Matronics prey on children with no known case of an adult victim. It isn't known where Matronics bring their children prey, however, they are never seen again. Matronics, although dangerous, they are easy to terminate and capture. The past five years, agents of ERD children have been targeted by Matronics and have taken 107 to date. The research goal this year is finding why Matronsis are targeting agent children and how to redirect their targeting. Huh. All right. Entity, E59. Nickname, oh, yeah. Skinwalker. <laughs> Class, Doppelganger. Threat, Severe. Containment, Moderate. Utility, Significant. Skinwalkers are ancient Shapa shifters usually taking the form of animals and uncommonly humans, stealing their skin in the process. Skinwalkers are incredibly violent and when killed leave behind nothing but their body vector. Skinwalkers have a hard time replicating the natural movements of creatures they take control of. Skinwalkers can often be identified by unusual eye size or loose skin. The research goal this year is finding a systematic way to identify skinwalkers 99% of the time and finding out defensive measures that can be taken to prevent loss of possession of body. You ever just try asking them? Might be worth it. Say please. Entity, E59. Nickname, The Rake. Class, No. no. Threat, it's Moderate. Rake. Containment, Moderate. No, I know Utility, that. Low. After the elimination of the Wendigo, a new creature has seemingly taken its place in the Midwest of America and Southern Canada. 
humanoid in shape. The rake has varying size limbs but usually conforms to a white pasty color skin. Rakes hunt at night and humans are their favorite prey. Rakes are susceptible to gunfire, yet are incredibly agile and thus hard to shoot. The research goal this year is finding out the cause of their resurgence and the correlation after the Wendigo eradication. Is there a point of taking out entities, if there is always a bigger fish? This feels like a love letter to like, horror of... A brief quiz will now begin. Okay, quiz time. Begin. I should have been paying attention, shouldn't I? I didn't even know you could actually do Oh, well, okay. Okay. Well, guess we're just... Guess I don't get to retry that. Cool. Fine. Whatever. No test one. The final exam will now begin. A mixture of content from previous modules. Begin. Okay. Huh? Face. We're doing the faces. Uh, fake. You are not real. Dang it. Did you check the latch? Did you check the latch? Okay. Are you serious? Are you serious? Yes, yes I am. That's it. Uh, yeah, that one, right. said there I just heard <laughs> I don't say anything no for it. <laughs> Actually, I don't know what that is but 
Use my camera. Well, now I'm. I don't. I guess I'm disappointed. Now click to progress. Is that it. PBA. Oh. It's just like not use my fa okay. I was kind of hoping it was gonna use my uh, face cam. I guess I guess not. All right, whatever. Okay. Hmm. All right. Well, I I guess that's it. This has been the Lancaster Week. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to play more horror games now. <laughs> <laughs>